Thank you for watching my channel. Please subscribe and like. Now back to the news. Eva Amory got emotional when reading mean comments online about her wedding dress after she tied the knot with Sheffy and Hawk in June. I felt hot here spring to my eyes in a way that brought me right back to middle school, the actress, 39, wrote on her blog, Happily Eva After on Wednesday. Here are people I didn't even know and who didn't know me, spending time and energy typing something that they hoped would bring me one thing and one thing only. Shame. Amory, who is the daughter of Oscar winner Susan Sarandon, said she hand-selected photos to submit to People magazine, in which she felt beautiful and exactly like herself. However, by the time the post was shared online, the photos garnered a lot of negative attention. I was so taken aback by the fact that it was already viral. And for two reasons completely out of my control. My breasts the newlywed said before noting that her natural breasts fluctuate with weight as a mom of three who has breasted all three kids. Are my breasts the same perkiness they were at 20 years old before they sustained human life three times over? Definitely not. Do I care? Some days more than others Amory added. But my body isn't something I'm ashamed of, and moreover, as any person with huge breasts knows, the more your decollete is exposed and opened up, the more flattering your clothing is to your whole figure in general. The middle of nowhere star said that some of the cool comments shared read, yes strapless dresses, are for everyone, awful inappropriate dress awful dress so unflattering. Put them away. That's the weirdest display of top oz my eyes have ever seen and trippy pubes. Amory said what made her feel yucky the most was the fact that she felt people had witnessed her family's joy in the photos, yet their goal was to try to hurt them. I was being picked apart by strangers for things I try to never qualify about myself, what my breasts look like in clothes, because I'm a human being just trying to feel beautiful, be a good person, raise my kids, and enjoy my life she said. Perhaps stupidly, it had never even occurred to me that people would have such a strong reaction to what my body looked like in a dress I'd pick for my own wedding. Amory said she purposefully asked to wear a sexy and elegant gown at all her dress appointments. She ultimately chose a strapless corseted dress with a column-shaped design by Kim Casas, which she paired with a billing skirt that she bought at Bridal Reflections in New York City. It had never occurred to me that people I don't even know would find my body so offensive, and especially that they would care so much about what I would choose to wear on my own wedding, Day Amory said. The saved. Star said it was unsettling for her to process the emotional aggression from strangers, but after some contemplation for a while, she realized that the problem here was them. Amory also took some time in her blog to defend fellow bride Olivia Culpo, who also recently caught flack for her more modest gown, stating women are f and can't win, no matter what they choose. What does society come to, when you can neither be sexy elegant, nor modestly elegant, on your own terms, at your own wedding? The Banger Sisters actress asked. Two women got married on the same day clothed vastly differently, and either was right. Like Amory, Nick Vile's wife, Natalie Joy, was also recently ridiculed over her bus bearing wedding dress. Some of y'all are actually being ridiculous with these comments the influencer hit back before explaining, yes I'm breastfeeding, so as the night went on my boobs got bigger. She added at the time, I was surrounded by people that I consider family and literal family. Nobody made it weird so y'all don't make it weird. Anyways continuing on with good vibes and wishing y'all the best.